Wow, all right, you, we got them all. You, usually these Torgs aren't so hostile. Something must be going on. L let's look around for somebody who can help us. I'm so lonely over here. I got all this great information I could share. I'm just sitting here. Hello there, friend. Can I help you? So, uh, what, what exactly are you doing out here? What? I'm fishing. You can tell I'm fishing, right? Oh, right. Duh, of course. Of course. Sorry. That, it's, it's very obvious. Yes. So, ha have you caught anything? No. Never have, never will. No fish can live down here in this sludge. If there aren't any fish in there, why are you fishing? What's, what is that? What's going on? Because I'm still working up the courage to drown myself. Yikes. Wow. Okay. TMI, maybe, a little bit. So, uh, how do you like living down here in the slums? It's sort of colorful down here, at least. What? Are you serious? This is one of the worst places anyone can live. You can't see that just by looking at it. It's more sludge than anything else, and the sludge is toxic. 
Oof, sorry. Yeah, that sludge does look pretty awful. No, the sludge is the best part. It's the quickest way out. Just hop in there and you got a one-way ticket out of here. Imagine if we didn't have the sludge. Then we'd really be trapped. Anyway, yeah. They're living here is bad. Do you know how we can get to Nine Torg? Buddy, all I know is fish, and I barely know fish. But let's just pretend there's a laundromat you can sneak through to get to Sludge Works over there. Are we pretending, or is there really a laundromat? Come on, kid, take the hint. Either we're pretending, or Nine Torg's goons kill me for squealing. Okay, I got it. We're pretending. Oh, Christ, just follow that path along the sludge. Uh, you're a wise old fisherman. Can you tell us a little bit about Nine Torg? Quiet. She's got ears everywhere, or antennae, whatever ants here with. Is she really that dangerous? Come on. I mean, she's just one gang lord. Just one? <laughs> what about the other eight Torgs? Wait, so the nine and nine Torg is, it's a counter? There's nine Torgs? Nine clones, yep. And that's just what's left. There used to be even more of them, but they always kill each other. Fighting for dominance over what? This hellhole? <laughs> This month, nine Torgs in charge. Last month, it was 14 Torg before they killed her. Now, nine Torgs fighting with five Torg. It never ends. Which one do you prefer? Oh, eight Torg is the hottest. Hey, thanks for the info, uh, wise fisherman. We'll see you later. Have a good day now. Oh, hey, you want to see a cool party trick I used to do? Aim me at the swag form. Come on. Fuck yeah, I told you. Did you see how fun that was? I call it my glob shot. It comes out of my trick hole. All Gatlians have a different kind of trick hole. But my yes! Yes! Oh, oh my god, I could do this all day. Do doesn't this fucking rule? God, I love spewing big gloopy globs. You're gonna need something. Like a knife to open those.
Look, don't shoot. I, I got an idea. It's another trick up my little slimy sleeve. Try hitting him with my glob shot. Take your time and aim right. You're gonna kill us now, aren't you? Oh, God. Please don't. Don't do that. Don't shoot a glob of your goop at us. <laughs> Thing like that. Oh, perfect shot! You fucking nailed it! How sick was that? Whew, okay, I gotta recharge. It doesn't take too long, but it's a little longer when there's enemies nearby, you know? My, my body gets too tense. It's, it's like trying to piss when someone's watching, you know? Yet. We're, we're gonna need something sharp. I thought we were strong, right? Remember when I went out weak? Are we weak? Are you weak? You just got squashed. Oh, God. This is the incomer. And now, dying. We're getting close. It's tough. I know it's tough. Just, just try again. Just try it one more time. I feel like we might just be like the real weak enemies, like just. A Torque. Let's keep moving. Hey, careful with the merchandise. Whoa, 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 hold up a bit. Let's listen. Line up and everything. They're gonna be here any minute. Just, just patient. Oi, fuck you! I'm sick of this. I want to tear through someone's guts. Oh, I think they're talking about Jean's knife. Ah, fuck you! Got it, freak. We've had enough of your bullshit. Yeah, it's your fault. Stevulax is dead. I was in love with him. Do you know that? I loved him, and I was heads cut off. Just the way it should be. Fuck him. Hey, guess what? I have another secret trick you can use. The power of negotiation. Let's try reasoning with these guys. Knock on the door. Tell me how oh, you want to play this. Fuck you, insufferable fucking cunts. Uh, who's there? Who are you? Uh, hey. Hello there, friends. Oh, I, I think it's the buyer. Hey, are you the buyer?
Uh, yeah, we're here to uh, buy buy a knife. You guys are selling a knife, yeah? Oh, perfect. You're really late. We were starting to get worried. Just go with it. No shooting. All right, here's the product. A genuine talking knife. I gotta be honest with you, he's a real piece of shit. He's extremely violent. He basically only talks about wanting to kill people in very disturbing ways. Fuck you, I'm gonna carve out your anal cavity. Gonna make it three times as big. Your shit's just gonna drop right out of there. Let's see what I'm talking about? Oh, uh, perfect. That's exactly what we're looking for. Yeah, yeah, great. Go ahead. Feel free to inspect. Oh, fuck yes, thank you. Pleased to meet you. I'm Knifey. Now use me, use me. Let me fucking stab these cocks. Oh, just a reminder, uh, don't do anything crazy when you're holding the knife. Just, like, look at it, see if you like it, put it back. Yeah, thank you. What the fuck are you waiting for? Excuse me, come on, stop, stop, stop! So, do you find the knife satisfactory? Do you want to buy it and not stab us with it, please? Oh, fuck yes! Finally! You have no idea how long oh, I've yes, been thinking fuck about yes. this! More, more! I need more stabbing! Hey, you! Listen! Point me at your raw, fleshy little tummy and jab me right into there! Let's get all those guts torn up! Let's see that fucking red goop spill out! I can't stop now! Oh, uh, that's a pass for us! Is this really the knife Gene was talking about? Gene? Did you just say Gene? Okay, change of plans. Bring me to Gene, so I can fucking decapitate him! Wait, what? Why? He sent us to rescue you! Oh, that's rich. There's no way I'm forgiving him, though, for leaving me with that fucking Nine Torg. He's dead to me! Huh? You know Nine Torg? We're trying to kill her! Oh, perfect! Finally, we're on the same page! Let's kill Nine Torg, then Gene! Okay, definitely Nine Torg, but l l let's put a pin in the, the whole Gene thing. H how do we get out of here? With my tether ability! I'm more than just a knife, you racist! I can tether too! Look up and latch! John! Fucking cool, right? You gotta use me to swing across this sludge. What the fuck are you doing? Didn't you hear me? I'll help you swing off that bug. Oh, fuck yeah! Not as good as stabbing, but still pretty good. Well, all right. Where, where to next? The Sludge Works processing plant. Nine Torg was talking about some traitor she had to deal with. Probably another one of her clones. Five Torg or six Torg or whatever. I don't know. There's too many now. There's too many Torgs. How many clones are there? Who the fuck cares? Stop thinking so hard and just look for the big Sludge Works sign. I want to stab somebody. Excuse me! I can open those fuckers up real good! And there's loot inside for you too! Win-win! Yes! So you, uh, mentioned that Gene gave you to Ninetorg? Cave? Try gamble me away in a game of space poker? That sack of shit! Can't wait to stab all three of his fucking eyes! Even the wonky one! Especially the wonky one! Hate that one! If you're looking for Ninetorg, we're going the wrong way! Gene, didn't he used to be a hero? Yeah, he used to be. Hard to tell these days, right? Towards the end, the only thing I was cutting for him was sandwiches. Not even the good ones. Peanut butter sandwiches. And no fucking jelly. Not even like ham or anything good. Nine Torg character's deal anyway. She's the current matriarch of the Torg family. I say current because they're always killing each other for the top spot. You know how it is with clones.
You want some treasure? Is, is he talking to us? Oh, you're not interested in some shiny, sexy treasure? Huh? Sure, I get it. What's inside? Want treasure. Hmm, maybe you just don't know what treasure is. Well, it's usually really good. It's valuable and highly sought out. So getting some would be good for you. Come on. This is a Some Gatorol. That, 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 that'll fill me back. Whoa! Thank Jesus. Okay, feed me that Gatorol, baby. Come on, put it in my little mouth. I have dignity, you know. I'm not. I'm not about to beg you to feed me Gatorol. Feed me the Gatorol. What's wrong with you? That's the spell. Sludge works. Nine Torch should be here. Brother, fight my end, brethren. Fight for your lives, and the bears are falling. And another wave? Are you kidding me? Oh my God! The end kills. There's even more powerful. Oh, to believe. Wow, I feel really powerful. Do you feel powerful? We're unstoppable. Is this bloodlust? Am I feeling bloodlust right now? Oh yeah, man. That's what I'm talking about. Now you're getting it. Oh man, I guess I am. Nightwork must be close. Let's ride this wave and kill her too. I want to fuck her up real good. Let's 
Let's glob them. You know what I bet? I bet we're the strongest enemies in the whole game. Come on, if you let us kill you, it'll make us climb the top rank. You know damn well this isn't sanitary and, and it hurts like fuck. came over me there. I think I got caught up in the moment or something, but hey, good work, team. Let's go get Nine Torque. Any last words, Five Torque? Is that Nine Torque talking? Fuck off! I've always said you were the worst Torg. You know, Seven Torg said the same thing. Right before I killed her. Damn you! And you're next. You got this! Yeah. 
I think she's basically done for. Bounty Hunter, I, I feel pretty good. I, I, I really didn't know if we'd be able to pull it off. All right, it's time. Time for what? Time to carve out a piece of her. I'm thinking we go with a full slap. Oh, God, I can't look. I can't. I can't. <laughs> oh, fuck. Hell, she's a gusher. Can we have just taken, like, a fingernail, some spit, a, maybe a blood sample? Yeah, sure. Could have, I guess. Hey, I'm Five Torg. Thank you for killing my evil clone. I don't mind if you mutilate her corpse, really. It's fine. You did such a good job. That was, like, off the hook. You're not gonna take over and end up being just as evil as Nine Torg, right? Oh, don't worry. Things are gonna be a lot different around here. So, no more crime, then? Oh, not that different, then. Technically, all of us Torgs are evil clones, so I'm still gonna do a bunch of crime. But we're cool. Huh. Far as I'm concerned, you're a friend of the Torg family and welcome here anytime. An honorary Torg. You can be ten Torg. Now, if you'll excuse me, my day- All right, let's go home and turn in our first bounty. Hey, you know, that was some pretty solid bounty hunting back there. I mean, I mean, don't don't get too cocky about it or anything, but it was pretty cool. Yeah, not bad. That was some good killing. And I'm somewhat of a killing expert, actually. I can't wait to see Gene's face when he sees we pulled this off. Let's head back up through the slums tunnel. Hey, you thought you beat all the torgs, huh? I don't know why that guy even bothered attacking us. I almost feel bad. You know, feel free to keep exploring, but whenever you're ready, we just got to go through the tunnel that we ca came here in. You know, that tunnel? Take me to Gene and let's stab him in the gut. Wow. Oh, you're back. Hey, yeah, my leg's still very broken. Six feet, please. Worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. Have you ever had this happen to you? Help. Help me. Help me. Help me, please. Help. Oh. Huh. Why is the door closed? Help me. Oh. 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 Who is it? You got my munch dash delivery? Oh. Oh. What? No, it's us. Oh, shit. Really? Never. Good job. Oh, hold on! Is that Gene? Okay, get ready. I want you to stab me right into his fat little belly. 
What the hell, Gene? He installed new locks because he assumed you'd get killed. He keeps saying it's his house now. What? No. I just took the liberty of upgrading your security. Did you really kill Nine Talk, though? Yeah, we actually did. Well, well, well. Didn't think you had it in you. I'm really blown away. I'll be honest with you. I expected you to die. Oh, thank you. So, what did it feel like? Killing nine tog. Look, I gotta be honest, it felt good. It felt great. I mean... Hey, Gene, lift up that shirt and expose your soft little belly for me. I'm coming in hot. Yes. Forgot how psycho he was. Why don't you just, uh, hold on to him for now? Oh, sure, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll keep him far away from you. Yeah, thanks. Now, uh, go turn in your bounty at the Bounty 5000. I got it all set up for you. No, seriously, let me stab him. So, <laughs> what, you're some sort of bounty hunter now? What are you gonna save humanity? You only kill the bad guys, not the good ones. Yeah, pretty cool, right? Are you proud of your sibling here? <laughs> I mean, not really, but you, you enjoy, you enjoy. So, uh, what kind of stuff did you do in here? Like, anything gross? Y you have to tell me. Like, seriously, come on. We're best friends now.
have to do everything the fucking UI tells you to do. Yeah, fuck yeah. Fuck you, Jane, you piece of shit. Oh, shit, sorry. It's fine. I've lived through worse. Okay, he's tough. Let's try again later then. Well, there you go. You're a real bounty hunter now. Huh, would you look at that? I, I guess we're really doing it. Yeah, I didn't expect you to get your footing so quick. I don't even have any leads on any G3 bounties. You ever, uh, serious about going after them, huh? You bet. Well, we'll take them all down, including Garmantuous. Well, you're welcome to try, and if you do, you might want to go to the pawn shop and buy back the Dodge unit I pawned off. Forgot to tell you about it. Go scrounge up some pesos and buy that, or whatever else tickles your fancy. I'll have some G3. What, while you were off murdering a gang lord in the slums? How is it down there? Any cool shops, or is it just sort of depressing? Everyone up here just makes the slums sound really depressing. I'm probably just gonna not go down there, to be honest. But it is pretty crazy you killed a gang lord. And she was a woman, though. Not very feminist of you to kill a woman in power. You're really gonna need that Dodge unit from the pawn shop. The suit's not really complete without it. Look, I know Mr. Keeps annoying, but you gotta put up with him and buy back that Dodge unit. Okay. Fine. You don't want to go to the pawn shop? Well, I'm not doing any more research on the G3 until you do. Gene said you might have the old Dodge unit that goes with this bounty suit. Oh, yeah. We got that. Why? You want it? I want it, too. So it'll cost you. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, we, we know how buying stuff works. Excellent. There. there you go, one Dodge unit. Have a nice life! All right, we got it. Let's try this bad boy out and then head back to Gene. Jor, be a doll and tell the customer to stop climbing on our shelf. No, I think it's cool they're doing that. I think it kicks serious ass. I hope you enjoy it. If you touch me again, I'll eat your head. Boy, you are always in some kind of rush, aren't you? I'm not judging. I'm just, just, just observing. You know, old people, they get horny. It's just part of life. We're not gonna stop having sex. We're not gonna stop being horny. That's all, that's my... Okay, great. You got the Dodge unit. So how about it? Think you're ready for the big leagues, kid? What, what do you mean? The big league! The G3 cartel! That's the next step, taking down their head officers. Okay, um, are you, are you positive that we're ready for that? Yeah, whatever. Might, might as well try. But they won't be pushovers like Nine Torque, so, uh... Well, to be honest, I don't care if you live or die. You know that. You know my whole deal. But, uh, hey, it's your funeral. So go check out the Bounty 5000 whenever you're ready. Got two G3 leads for you right now. Krubus and Douglas. You can pick which one you want to let kill you first.
Zephyr Paradise. Gorgeous, huh? Cartel knows we're here. Wow, they only brought me here a couple of times. Looks like they haven't ruined this part of the jungle yet. Like fish? Is that did that translate right? Translator microbes. We're gonna kill you, you fucking mites! something gets free, you know? Oh shit, that's a lot of mites! Felt good to get that out of me! things. Okay, do you know what fan plants are? You shoot the little book. Okay, yeah, you, you figured it out.
I can't hear you. I'm heading into a tunnel. No, I'm just kidding. Just some uh, cell phone humor just to lighten the mood, you know? Oh, a Fergal den. Oh, man, you, you, you know, you actually have a lot in common with these guys. You know, aside from all the hair, you know, you're both being sold as drugs to, for aliens to get a high off of, you know? You guys are, uh, it's, it's like you're almost related in a way, you know, if you think about it. Jeez, I didn't want to embarrass them back there, but that tunnel reeks of Fergal shit. Killing these weak fucks doesn't do- Oh shit, okay, G3 are warping in. You ready to fight? You, you, you need a pep talk? If only they were all this weak, you know? shot, you know? I think we can help. Really? Thank you. It sucks so much watching everyone you know getting enslaved. I don't want to be rude or anything. It's just that you said you'd help save all of my friends. They're just up in that village up ahead. will just die.
not too heavy, am I? I, I get a little self-conscious. You know, you're always holding me up and right in front of you. And, oh, God, I always worry about that. Am I, am I, like, I don't want you to get too tired from holding me or anything. I'm glad I'm on your team. I get to stab a lot of people, and you get to stab a lot of people, so it's a win-win for both of us, really. Trying to kill everyone, Jesus! I got an idea. Tr try launching that Merc with the fan plant. Warming with cartel guys. How, how, how do you want to deal with this? I can't believe the mob woods live in this crappy village. Their lives must suck. Yeah, well, we did enslave them. Well, of course their lives suck now, but I mean, big problem. Well, why are you even interfering? Now? Leave me alone. The mob woods are being enslaved.
some point, right? native to this planet. Uh, hi there. Did you save us from the G3? Yeah, I, I, I guess so. You know, do, do we get, like, a, a reward? Uh, we don't have much. Maybe you should hit up our leader? Savior. My people were enslaved by the G3 and forced to desecrate the land mining for Fergals. You may have freed this small tribe, but our brethren underground are still being worked to death by Krubis. The G3 are a cruel bunch. They did tests on us to see if we could trigger psychedelic reactions like a drug. But when we proved useless in that regard, they put us to work mining Fergals instead. Man, good God, you know, you, you, you just can't win. You're either a drug or you're a slave, I guess. Yes, and those poor Fergals, so helpless. They're making us destroy their lives, their habitats. It's so gruesome. Basically, our lives are super fucked. It's, uh, it's not good. But you freed us. Everything changes now. Krubis. You know, we're actually looking for him to kill. What's this? You aim to take down Krubis of the G3? You are truly a hero to Moplets everywhere. Yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, where is he? We'll, we'll get rid of him for you. Hmm. That's difficult to answer. His work, though evil, keeps him very busy. He oversees many different mines across Zephyr, and it's impossible to predict where he may be on any given day. My liege, 
What about the man in the mansion? Ah, of course, a brilliant plan. My advisor is right. There's a man nearby who knows Krubis and has access to a warp device. We may be able to use him. He lives in a mansion across the river. If you could get your hands on his warp device, that could be very useful. Okay, sure, a guy in a mansion, that, 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 that's the plan? Yes, he would appear to be our best chance. Godspeed, savior. Can you tell us a little more about Krubus? I've only come face to face with him a few times, but he's he's an irritable one, that Krubus. I think he resents having to manage the mines. Probably would prefer doing something a bit more glamorous. And he takes all his frustrations out on us. Oh man, I'm sorry. Sadly, there's nothing that can be done about it. Unless you kill him, that would do the trick.
What's the guy in the mansion like? Oh, his name is Ranchi Delarma. He warped in not too long ago. Seems to be old acquaintances with Krubus. We haven't dealt with him much, but he seems to have a penchant for Fergals. Oh, God, he's a drug addict. Nonetheless, we may be able to use that to our advantage. He does have close ties with Krubus, after all, and he seems a bit disoriented. Right, because of the drugs. A and he's evil still, right? Well, yes, he's evil, so it should be morally just. Yes, let's all just agree right now that it's morally just to manipulate him. I love it when we can agree. Hey, thanks for your help. Very well. Godspeed, saviors. There we go, got him open for ya. Looks like it's locked. You know, maybe someone around here knows the way in. in over here. I bet we can cross now. You're the one who fucked up the coordinates. How are we gonna get this thing out of the river? I fucked them up. I just typed in what you told me to type in. Yeah, you typed it in wrong, dickhead. Now we're flooding. Oh, sure. It's always my fault. You know what? I'm asking for a transfer when we get back. Oh, wouldn't that be nice? Go ahead. I can't wait. Ah, fuck you. Fuck you. Yeah, fuck you. Oof, that was some good old-fashioned conflict mediation. And you know my mother, oh, oh, 
see, she always said, oh, you'll join JP one day. You're not good, Quentin. She always was saying it about you. You're not good. As if my three hearts couldn't have goodness in them. I don't even want to get started on her. I have no idea what it's like to have a mother who doesn't support your dreams. All I ever wanted to be was a jungle seamstress. I wanted to grab the purple trees and create amazing clothing for the farmers. That's that. But no, no one believes in me. No one gave me the core box to save up. So I joined the G3 out of desperation. That it way to feel something. You really want to shoot me, huh? Oh, like I was saying. I've been aimless most of my life. Uh, I'm alone here, to be honest, and just in a valley covered with sludge and Fergals. But at least the Fergals don't judge me. Not like my mother! Oh, I don't even want to get into it! She drove my father away when I was only six clicks old! Do you know how embarrassing it is? Haha, <laughs> yeah, keep trying to do me! This is fun! I still go to my mother's lily pad, and I still heal her. Take care of her when she's sad. Because I'm a good boy, regardless of what she thinks. Regardless of what choices I've made in the past. I didn't want to get started on my choices I've made, on my relationships I've had. Oh, Tiffany, oh, I had a real one. She was so pure. She could sing like an angel, oh. And then I fucked it up. I lied to her about what I did. She said, Quentin, leave and never come back. Now she's a Clint Clark creature. And good therapy, good therapy. And he's doing everything he can. That was a classic ricochet. You don't see that every day. No, sorry. I'm writing about that in my diary. Yes, I have a diary. So what? It's not embarrassing to me. I write it every time I jack off. So anyway, I'll just sit here alone in my valley and just think about her. Just wish, pray for the one time our intro can thrust together again. And you know, I just, I I don't even know where to begin, what to end. I've been all over. Just trying to find someone real. I dated a mom once. Huh, they're fucking nuts. I don't want to get started into their lives. Let's just say it didn't work. You know, I'm tired of just giving and giving. That's why I quit the G3. I, I just couldn't goop another person. You know how much it takes out of you to goop someone it hurts? And personally, I only want to goop someone I'm in love with. Make sure they're not using me, because I've dealt with that before. Had a, a, my, 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 you're sipping on my. Oh, so, so to continue, and I'm I just, hubba, hubba, quite the landing. That's not your first time on a zip line, is it? Oh, I didn't think so, because you seem so experienced. We, we gotta get through here fast. So anyway, it's nice just to hang out sometimes. See what you're doing. All right, you, you remember we're trying to get to that mansion, right? You're a bounty hunter, obviously. Yeah, I can see that. Uh-huh. Hey, <laughs> you, you, you gotta, you gotta buy something. P please, I'm fucking dying here. What? What's the fucking game to you? You didn't yeah, buy anything away in there. Don't you care? About families you trying to, to support back, themselves. Like you can support local business, you son of a Hello? bitch. Hello? That's Hello? all we have are the small business people got a store. who I got a store. care about putting food on their table and helping their children be hey, better God, people God, than God, they were. Oh Whatever happens I, to I, the I world to dream stuff. where you can Check dream big, bigger business, and drink tire small. But it's okay. No judgment here. It's no skin off my back. You don't have to buy stuff if you hate everything. Oh, so so to continue, if, if I had a knife that talked, I would be a happy man. Huh? So you're... Oh, whoops! I just realized I'm late for my big date. 
I'm gonna go fuck another really hot gritten. Wish me luck. It was so like me. Finally, thank God. I don't know how much more I could have taken. mansion how much do you think it costs to maintain a place like this you know oh fuck yeah oh hey you made it you got my fresh fergals what yeah this is the guy we're looking for come on come on come on hand over the fergals i need my fix so i can get back to working on these resort plans you know <laughs> i can feel the shakes coming Krubus filled you in, right? He said he'd send someone over with another batch. Is that you?
Huh, I don't see a warp device on you. <sighs> Come on, is Krubus making you hoof it around on foot? Oh, that cheapskate bastard, same old Krubus. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> Here, I got an extra. Don't let anyone ever tell you Ranchi's not a generous fella, okay? There's an unused warp disc in there, too. You know, warp in whatever's on there. I don't care. It's free of charge. There's a river near here you can probably cross with it. Oh, man, go nuts. <laughs> Warpaholics. <laughs> wow, th thank you. Hey, hey, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Lean in close. Get close to me, man. I'm sure Krubus told you I'm here on Zephyr to break ground on a new Delarmo Land Resort. Yeah, I'm that ranchy Delarmo, CEO, Delarmo Industries. This one's gonna be even better than the one on Glassboard 12. Trust me, man. That guy's busy as shit, always hopping from site to site. He's got like 30 different mines all across Zephyr. You think I can keep track of that? Fuck. I see him when I see him, okay? I, I wish he'd take some time off, though. Hey, I want to talk to him about Delarmo land. I, I'm sure you've been to Delarmo Land before, probably the flagship Glashborg 12 location, but buddy, you would not believe the regulations we had to abide by over there. Real motherfucking sticklers. So I hit up Krubus, you know, make a deal with the G3, and now we're setting up a brand new location here on Zephyr where ain't nobody gonna breathe down our necks about safety protocols or background checks on all the performers. <laughs> and you're probably wondering why nothing's been built yet. Well, I might have got a little bit sidetracked. Drawing up blueprints takes a lot out of me, you know? So I unwind with a little Fergal or two. Sue me. But we're making good progress. Yeah? Or will be. Soon. Another thing. Check out the scale model of the new Delarmo land, cause <laughs> it's got a lot of detail. <laughs> it's gonna be the planet's only all-inclusive pansexual drug bazaar. On the beach, you can get your rocks off while getting your surf on. And I can have all the Fergals I want. That's just a perk on top of a rock-solid development plan. And once I stop enjoying the perk, I'll get right back to planning this resort. Any day now, as soon as I've had my fill of the Fergals. Oh, man, Krubus. <laughs> what a guy. You see that photo over there? That's the snap of me and the crew, man. That shit was like, I don't know, 20 years ago, man? That's how long we've known each other. He used to be a real wild man before he turned into such a frickin' stodger. You know? Mm, I got clean. Mm, I got sober. <laughs> All paperwork and shift management. I mean, crew man, you work for the space mafia. You'd think you'd still have a little fun every now and then. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sweating. <laughs> I am sweating so hard right now. Sorry for all the rambling. Uh, what are you still doing here? Look, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm totally fucking jonesing over here, huh? Not that I can't quit Fergals anytime I want. You know, that'd be so easy, kid. Trust me, super easy. <laughs> Why the fuck are you still here? God, I'm so sorry for freaking out like that. I'm just, I'm getting a little tense. You know, when you kind of had a little bit too much burgle and your bones hurt. <laughs> yeah, I have bones. Shocker. Okay, uh, uh, okay, okay, the high is wearing off and I'm starting to feel a little antsy, okay? I need some Fergals, pronto! Uh, 
Yeah, okay, I get it. I've got a nice place. But please, for the love of God, get me some Fergals. <laughs> I was fucking with you, man. No, but... All right, uh, okay, we got a warp okay, device. Okay, um, you know, that's going to be helpful. Why don't we use uh, it to now, cross where, this river I? so we can go Gosh, talk to the Moplets and check in okay. with them? Yeah, bye, I guess. Jeez. Looks like they're working on fixing this portal. You know, hey, maybe we can use it later, you know? Okay, uh, let's use this warp device Ranchy gave us to cross the river, huh? Hey there, it's me, Pseudo. I'm back. Uh, looks like you're trying to use that new warp device you just got. Uh, you want me to help you out? Great work! Wow, wasn't that fun? Okay, see you later. I'm diving right back into Gene's old porn archives. Even AI can jack off. Shit, nice work. You know, we can use this base as a bridge. Come on, fucking move. Hey, where you want me to fucking go, huh? You want us to just disappear all this fucking traffic? Hey. Holy shit, where the fuck are we? Hey, who gives a you shit? You want to check in with the Moblet leader? Because, you. you know, hey, that's kind of what we're supposed to do right now. How was the man in the mansion? R Ranchy? Yeah, that guy has serious problems, but he gave us this warp device. By the gods, you've done it. You got the warp device. This might actually work. You continue to provide us with hope, Grand Savior. With this warp device, you can warp Krubus directly to you. How fortuitous. But alas, you'll need his coordinates and a blank warp disk to encode them onto. Hmm. Oh well, no way you're getting those. That stuff's in the mines. We could just go down there and get it right now. All right. Take this access code and head down to the mines. Everything you need is there. Okay, perfect. Thank you. You know, you, you guys figured out that whole plan for us. You know, that really means a lot. You know, it clears things up for, for us, you know, anyway. Yep, uh, we'll, we'll get it done. All right, let's use the passcode and get in. Nice. Jeez, are the G3 even trying to domesticate the local mites? G3 ran into trouble. Right, maybe they'll sort this out themselves. Is this the entrance to the mines? Jesus, they really fucked this place up. I didn't know it had gotten this bad. These guys just don't let up, do they? Oh shit, Grintons. Gotta be honest, uh, you know, they're, they're working for the G3, but still better than our friend from earlier. Oh great, these guys heal up the G3.
slime out of my trick hole. What's so gross about that? That's probably somebody's pet. Okay, this should take us down into the mines. Going down, huh? Sorry, I, I almost... 
almost made a crest joke, but I'm, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it. We're better than that. No crest jokes from me. That's a promise. Not from me, anyways. You might warp in some bases, and Lord only knows. But, you know, from me over here as a gun character sidekick, no crest jokes. 100% on the level with you and no bad stuff. Fuck, it stopped? Is. Let's get to work. See? It's me, Krubus. Speak there! Oh, shit. Hey, he's got a galleon! We, we gotta rescue it! Okay, yeah, there's no way we're getting past that laser grid. There's gotta be some, some way to shut it off somewhere around here. Forgot that if you piss me off, I will kill you. It's really easy to farm more squares. Do your job and mine more Virgos. Crew is out. Mining Operation 12C. This is Krubus again. One of you weird moblet fucks just to me you want to know how I know that the fact fucking dead? Looks like most of them got crushed in a cave-in. And I punished the mob that's responsible, but it looks like they died in the cave-in. Don't let it happen again.
Whip out knifey! What's up, fuckers? It's me, Krubus again. Someone filled out the wrong super deck. Tell me whose fault it was. I wish I could promise you I won't kill you, but I'm definitely gonna kill you! No, I don't know what they look like. Uh, excuse me? I've gotta go. We'll talk more later. Bye, Merle. I'm so sorry. I didn't see you there. I'm Helen. I just need to know, are you the new hire or the new boss? Uh, as a matter of fact, um, I, I am. I am the new boss. Absolutely. Yeah, right. You're not, honey. <laughs> That's funny, though. I like when the new hires have a sense of humor. <laughs> Let's get y'all set up. Head on into the next room and find a place to work. Go on without me. I haven't left this chair in years, and I don't plan to start now. <laughs> Honey, you can't wait out here all day. The bathrooms are for employees only, and you have not made it clear whether you work here. I cannot tell. I know what you're doing. You're waiting to see if I'm going to get out of this chair. This whole building could be demolished by a landslide and my mangled body would rot in the rubble before I leave this goddamn seat. Don't waste your time, honey. <laughs> this is very comfortable. I see sweetie all the time. I didn't say it because I have feelings for you. I don't have to explain myself. <laughs> But I certainly can see myself developing feelings for you, given enough time. Oh, thank God they're here. Hey, you must be the new office clerk, right? Just sort through that paperwork for us. We're so sorry. Uh, sure. Uh, yes. I will see what I can do. Oh, jeez. Okay, this is more paperwork than I anticipated. All right, better get to work. So, we still good for Hyper Feast later? What time did you say again? Uh, Zork. Oh, yeah. Zork totally works. Hey, newbie. You know Hyper Feast? They create new life in front of you, and you get to eat it alive? Shit's wild, man. Hyper Feast. <laughs> See you there, girlfriend. You're my girlfriend. We're dating. 
Oh my god, I'm going insane. I'm going fucking nuts. What? Yeah, I, uh, God, I think my brain's breaking. I, I think doing this job is making my brain break completely. Oh, yeah, me too, me too. It's fun. You don't mind your brain breaking? Well, you don't mind the, this fucking monotonous nightmare work? No, no, it's nice. It's cool to just give into a broken brain. I can't do math anymore. And if I stay here another year, I think I'll forget how to say three-syllable words. Okay, that honestly doesn't sound so bad. And done! Finally! It's not bad. It's terrific. Fantastic. Amazing. Three words I won't be able to say next year, so savor them now. Oh, buddy, I will. We say for hyper feast again. God, don't you listen to anything? We said Zorg. Zorg. Ah, right, right. Damn. I just remembered I had something going on at Zorg. Holy shit. I, I'm, I'm gonna blow my fucking brains out. What? Oh, I didn't see you there. Do you, do you still sit here? That's so funny. Yeah, this is still my spot. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. It does, it does, yeah. I, I, I think if I if I sit back down at my desk, my soul is just gonna leave my body. Okay, well, I've got work to do. Yeah, I know, me too. I, I have to do all this fucking work. This is the whole fucking problem, man. Look, just because we used to be married doesn't mean you can keep leaning on me to work through your issues. That was one night. We got married for one dumb night and had 16 kids. You need to leave me alone. Oh, jeez, yeah. No, I mean, I'm so sorry. All in a day's work. Glad we got that all done. There, are, there definitely is not going to be a third stack. Ah, uh, the cold sting of irony. Is is that ironic? I, I never really know. Oh, jeez, yeah. No, I'm, I'm so, so sorry. Yeah. I didn't mean to bother you like that. Uh, uh, it, it's fine. Just uh, please, just let me get back to work. I gotta be honest. I totally forgot we used to be married and had 16 kids together. That, that's not why I came over here. I, I just think you're nice and, and pretty and good at listening. Uh, really? Because I am. I, I'm nice and good at listening. Oh, yeah. I, I know that very well. Oh, wow. Well, I... I think you're nice and good at listening, too. And you have a very hot body. Oh my god, thank you. <laughs> That's so nice. Um, hey, would, would you maybe, like, want to get some drinks tonight? Uh, like, maybe around Zorg? Oh, uh, I, I made plans tonight. Uh, actually, yes. I'm free. I'd love that. Oh, okay, we're done. No more paperwork. Did you hear me? I said no more paperwork. Not even a fourth stack. Okay, good. God! Damn, you filled out those papers like a son of a bitch. Like a real bitch you are. Fuck you, you're, you're promoted. You're free to go into Krubus' office. Why? Because fuck you. That's why I don't need a fucking reason. I'm Boss McBossington. And I'll be in here jerking off or whatever. Fucking other stuff too. I don't, I don't give a shit. Huh, so this must be Krubus' office. There's gotta be something here we can use. Wait, I feel like we missed something in there, you know? Look, I know it seems hard to find out where Krubus is, but you can do this. You know, you can find it. It's not, it's not like there's that many things in here. Krubus, where are you? This is Garmantuous. I just checked the log and you're three days by- Oh, would you look at that? He, he marked his coordinates on the calendar. Shit. All right, now we just need a blank warp disk to encode this on. What is 
has it. I wish I could promise you I won't kill you, but I'm definitely going to kill you! Ow, I know this is hurting you too, so get the fuck out of this shit! What's wrong with you? What's going on? Ah, don't, don't oh. get me in trouble. No, no, it's okay. We're friends. We, we hate the G3, too. Oh, wonderful. Thank God. Ugh! All right, we are off. What's your plan? We have started a resistance. Not only do the G3 enslave us, but they have desecrated our holiest of sites and absconded with our sweet prince. Prince Chosen One, that's, that's him. Prince Chosen One. Oh, that's awful. So, so you kidnapped this G3 merc as a bargaining chip to get your prince back? Uh, oh, hmm. yeah, that's smart. No, we, we didn't think of that at all. But it's fine, we know where the prince <clears throat> is. They swapped him out with the rest of our sacred grounds when they warped in a new base. So you want us to go clear it out and then <gasps> warp the throne room back? Oh heavens, would you really do all that for us? The base is just past this tunnel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Listen, we're looking for a blank warp disk. Do, do you have any ideas? Ah, uh, yes. Our prince has a stash of them. Really? All you need to do is clear out the warp base the G3 plopped on in our holy land. <gasps> then you'll reclaim the sacred grounds and rescue Prince Chosen One. And then he'll give us a blank disk? Yes, oh yes. We, we can help each other. Oh, what a fortuitous <sighs> happenstance. Oh. Oh! <gasps> 
Is his name really Prince Chosen One? Yes. He was named as such according to the prophecy. And then after that, he was made to do a prince. So you trust your leaders to prophecies. Is he a good prince? Well, the prophecy doesn't guarantee he's going to be good at his job. It just tells us who to pick. Look, I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Look, now is not the time to criticize us. We're, I'm just, you know, we're distressed as it is. I'm just doing my job. Wow, you know, we, we're about to rescue a prince. You know, I'm a, I'm a little nervous. You know, I, I hope he lives up to the hype. Hey, listen, when is a prince? Oh shit, this must be the place. Okay, let's clear it out. I wish I could promise you I won't kill you, but I'm definitely gonna kill you.
shot, bounty hunter. and use this to reverse the warp. chosen one and what the hell do you want jeez it jeez we, we just saved you you know maybe you could be a little grateful saved me from what i'm fine look we were told you had some sort of blank warp disc huh yeah 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 sure i've got a bunch
Okay, we got everything we need. Let's get back to Ranchy's place and see if he, you know, can help us encode them onto this machine. Prince Chosen One is returned. Oh. Side. Hey, uh, you're back. Uh, thank God. All right, thank looks like it's working. Uh, uh, did you bring my burgle? Uh, I need a bed. Uh, I need my fix, kid. Uh, I need a bed. I need it real bad. Oh Jesus Christ, man! Hey, are you all right? Uh, are you are you having a heart attack or? or is it is it Fergal withdrawals? Does that make you happy? Oh, you love that, don't you? You love to see him, uh, master of industry, all. Flummox like this, all low and, uh, yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh, -huh. uh maybe this is a bad time, but could we use your disk encoder real quick? What? No, the encoder is off limits until I get my goddamn Virgil fix. Virgils, get them. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Uh, hey, tell you what, we're gonna go ahead and use the disc encoder while you're sort of, uh, stuck on the ground like that, doing whatever it is you're doing. So, don't be mad at us. Fuck. A man lying and sweating in his own shit fest. You're a pervert. I fucking hate you. You don't even All like right, me. there we go. Time you to warp in Krubus like and then, friend. you know, kill him if, 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 if we're able to. Me. You ready? You don't even work for Krubus, do you? You were never even going to ever get my Fergals. Uh, please, get me Fergals. Hey, I've got a crazy idea. What if we just swap out this mansion for Krubus's base?
Where you going, you fool? Jack off? How dark it is! Shit, Dick Hurd! 
last of them! Up there, wasn't I? Sorry about that. Ooh. Hey, bud, the name's Gus. Feel good to meet you. Look at you, man. Pretty slick taking out Krubus like that, rescuing me from indentured servitude, etc. etc. I love that kind of stuff. You know what? I love that. That's the kind of stuff I love, man. Do you mind if I tag along with you for a bit? I, of course. I, I, that's what I was hoping you'd say. We can use your help. But I should be clear that we are trying to take down the whole G3 cartel, and we might die. Music to my ears. You think I don't want to take down the cartel? Buddy, that's all I want to do. That's all I dream about. Amazing. God, I'm so glad to find another Gatlian alive and well. I love your tiny little hands, by the way. I, I, I had a cousin who had those tiny hands. He died in the zombie apocalypse on Gatlas, but, you know, look, I'm sure you don't want to hear about that. We had to live through it. I mean, you know, who wants to talk about that? Here's what I do. I shoot discs, right? They stick onto certain walls, and you can climb with them. Let me show off my disc launching trick on that ledge. Oh, I get it. You love this pit, but you're gonna love my disc trick even more. See, 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 that's what I'm talking about. Now climb up there. Aren't you glad you met me? Oh shit, time to fight. Oh, okay. Hey. No, no. I just said use the vacuum. Use the damn vacuum. far away. I'm not sure you can jump to that one. Oh, hey! It's me, Quentin the Grin again, your best friend. I actually decided to patch things up and rejoin the Jake 3. Do you mind if I kill you real quick? <laughs> Let's see how much you talk when you're dead. Oh, I got 
this. Oh. The, I got this. Okay, ha ha ha, we got it. What if you just shot yourself with one of these stallions? Just aim it right at your head and just pew pew pew, blow your whole brains out. Ha ha. Can I convince you to do that for me? Enough of that guy. They kicked him out of the G3 because he was so damn annoying. He's lonely, he's bitter, and get a life. Some people need a life, and he needed a life, man. But now that we're out of the pit, I really feel free. You were side eyeing me. Wake it up. You think I'm supposed to be impressed that you killed a G3 officer? Y well, okay, you're fine. I am. I think it's pretty insane you didn't die. That's all you're getting out of me. Now, turn that bounty in. Tenders. 